Hello, I'm Andrew Lissim. Welcome to House of Iron 4 as the British Empire, Nazi Britain. We're currently at war with, well, it's just Brazil now, unfortunately. Brazil decided to be a big shot on the international stage, and unfortunately, they actually were fairly difficult to uh, counter. However, we are now making some progress. The annoying thing is, so much jungle. Um, but we are managing to slowly get there. Now, we just need to take Sao Paulo. Managed to take uh, Rio de Janeiro. Peru? No. Decline. God damn it, Peru. Nobody likes you. Right. Uh, what do we want down here? Probably nothing. Nothing here. Hmm. We can start on rocket artillery. Just because it's there more than anything else. Ah, they managed to get it, but we're going to kick them back. That's fine. And, yep, this pocket will finally be destroyed. How are we doing down here? Yeah, the salt's going vaguely well. I say vaguely well because it's not perfect. Uh... Yeah, they're pushing back. They want to take Rio. God damn it. No, 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 no. You do not take Rio. I don't know why my troops have just are completely abandoned the front. I'm pretty sure I didn't tell them to do that. But if I did, whoops. There we go. Managing to defend Rio there. Right, let's get you pushing in. You've got great organization, but your equipment is terrible. Probably should lend lease like South Africa in that. Now I've got lots of supplies. Come on, Sao Paulo. Okay, so I've got a massive surplus there. Right, let's pause for a second. Um, we're a surplus of units, blah, 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 from production, foreign equipment, reinforcements minus eight. Uh, so we've got plenty of artillery. What's this? Balance. So we are actually losing artillery overall, even though we're producing some. Because we're producing 43 and we're using 160. Reducing that, our daily need is 1,000. Our daily need, need is lower, but that's because we need to actually get enough mechanized. That said, we've got a lot stored. I assume that's all mechanized rather than like the upgraded that we need. Uh, we're using more me motorized than we have. Again, same for support supplies. I don't think I can give anyone anything because I need all of this stockpiled. Light tanks. We've got enough stockpile to go for a while. I haven't got enough modern tanks yet to be able to switch over to modern tanks. We're going to get there. Now, I'm a bit cautious, actually. We probably need to start producing more uh, support equipment and artillery. Because although, you know, we've got good stockpiles of some things, in a massive war, when we've got more people fighting on all fronts, we're probably going to end up with problems here. Certainly for support equipment, by the look of it. Mechanized, it's not too bad because we're just upgrading right now. Although I've been focusing on mechanized, it is just because of the upgrades. Total need. Oh, and also because some just died and it's now telling me the total need. But there is an upgrade of like 32,000 needed. But in terms of actual need at the front line, just nine. So we should switch over to support equipment on a couple of these. And, yeah, artillery on you as well. Uh, Burma Road? I can't do that because that's about China and stuff. Develop South Africa. Enjoy. Sao Paulo is ours. They're defending this port. Annoying. Oh, no, 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 no. Quick, get down there.
Come on, if we can take out this port. Brazil is so close to giving up. 4%. Ah, uh, there's not many victory points, unfortunately. Fairly rural country at this stage. That's why there's so few units over here. No divisions assigned to this push. Oh, actually, it's two different pushes, that's why. Okay, that makes sense. I have to just hold for a little bit while they attack us. Mm -hmm. We've sent like German tanks and everything. That's just unfair. Yeah, I need more troops down here. All of these troops I would like down here, please. There we go. There we go. I've got 129 on this, like, what? One, two, three, four tile wide thing. That's going to go well. Um, give you some support. Come on. You can take him. We've got the Avro Lincoln. Really far. Oh, 50% off. Still takes a year, but sure. It is four years ahead of time. A strategic jet bomber would be very nice right now. Okay, come on. Just keep pushing. Yes, Venezuela, you may send me more. Well, I've got a particularly useful idea for what to do with all that, but whatever. We're going to just cut this nine off. There we go. Now it's surrounded. Time to start suffering from attrition loss. Enjoy. Oh, God. Again, we've left this front. Damn it. Ah, we'll get it back. Ten units here. Oh, they are redistributing. I was just kind of wondering why there was quite a lot there. Failed push or something? I guess. Right, now. This is our push. Enjoy. And yes, I know it's a very unfocused push. But that's because I kind of want them attacking along a broad frontage to go support each other. Bridge Raj, 41 divisions. Sure. That's your entire army as far as I'm aware. You've sent me a load already. Oh my god, we've got uh, the full top level jet fighter now. Yes. I'm happy. It's this point you can't put them on uh, carriers, but. C'est la vie. Uh, we're already working on that. Land doctrine we've already got. I guess. We'll get a battle class. Production. Vampire. Thank you. All right, how are we doing with our construction so far? We're on to the nuclear reactors. 
Okay, so we've got all of the bunkers and stuff that we wanted done. Ah, they've got more units here now. No, don't redistribute. Keep pushing. We can win. Just need to push. I'm starting to run out of people again. Oh, they've capitulated. Yes! Okay, right. Philippines. Uh, take all states. Um, Brazil, take all... Ah, God damn it. Okay, I guess I have to leave some for... Wait, I need that to be able to connect... Oh. Done. Done. 19 states were taken. The war is over. British Empire rolls victorious once again. It's, it's a beautiful day. Uh, we need to plan a naval invasion. There we go. Seems like a good naval invasion to me. And same for you. Now, I'm going to need the Imperial Fleet to be able to cover quite a large portion. It's need to cover these two. We might need to split the fleet. Yeah, let's uh, split the fleet in half. I like the fact you can now actually uh, change who's in charge at sea. Right, select. You're going to be in charge of... Ah! My cursor ran away. It's not a good idea. That. 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 While my other fleet... Gonna be in charge of. Oh, whoops. Search and destroy. There. Are you on search and destroy, by the way? No, you're on patrol. No, you should be on search and destroy for sure. Against the Japanese, search and destroy the way forwards. Right. Fortify the rock. Coerce Spain. That's not really have much of an effect. We're gonna just fortify the rock. Nah, it doesn't really give us anything, because we've actually got max land forts there already. Let's go air defense in Hong Kong. Why not? Now, do I still have all the troops that I got given? I do. A uh, ridiculous number of troops. I don't need them in Brazil. Uh, flat out, that is just un not useful to me. So, uh, I'm going to unassign my commander here. I'm going to start assigning commanders to certain uh, groups, by the way. And... I think we should get 50, add them to here. Thirty-eight. No, 19, 19, add to here. Thirty-three. Um, let's make it 17 for now. Just be a little bit cautious to the Italian front. Uh, then let's get... How many have they got on this side? Enough to be an issue. Let's get you there. 22 up here. Ah, yes! We can fix Africa.
Already signed something there. We'll defend this. Mostly of troops that aren't really mine. Which is why I don't worry too much about it. Uh, and we can add any extra troops to that. Now, a lot of them are green, which is very unfortunate. I don't know why they keep just producing green troops and handing them to me. I guess it's if I have to do the training or something? I don't know. It's, it's frustrating. I don't really want to do that. Uh... Recruitment. No recruitment going on. That's fine by me. Uh, I should probably turn you into a division. A garrison division for now. I don't know where you're going. And I'm just going to get you to train. Because you're only uh, trained at the moment. I want you to get you to regular level. Probably should have just trained this as a group. But a bit late now. Uh, who else have I got? I don't think any of you were ever assigned. Yeah, Venezuela. Um... Yeah, this group could do with some more people. Right, we'll just make the British Raj defend that. Oh, we're going to have to defend this as well, aren't we? Um, I'll work on that. Right, this is Asia. Yes, it's already selected. Hopefully that'll defend that. Okay. Manpower issues. I am fully aware that there are manpower issues. Don't worry. I'm fully aware and already very, very sad. Oh dear, oh dear. Also, I've just got like, Australia's just like, hey, let's put a motorized division over here. That makes sense. And I'm like, what? Why? Why would you even consider doing that? I probably need more troops here. I don't know where this is, like, meant to be going. But I'm reassigning you. We need more defense up here. In fact, I need tanks up here. I've actually got none. Right, these four tanks. You've got a new uh, destination. Enjoy. The War of the Axis is not far off now. How long till I get my nuclear bombs? 15 days. Then it's going to be a case of producing nuclear bombs and going to war. My idea is if we can do it properly, we're going to just hit them with a load of nukes in one place and then move on to the next. Hit them with a load of nukes move on to the next and just keep doing that as quickly as, you know, rolling as quickly as possible. One after the other. Uh, we also need to produce strategic bomber. I don't have the ability to really edit it right now. I don't have enough tech uh, experience. I don't need crazy many. Yeah, two rows should be plenty. Let's also start assigning... Uh, commanders. So the most important commanders first. So let's look at Central Europe. Yeah, you're going to need a pretty decent commander. Um, I don't need the supply consumption bonus. Allenbrook. Max entrenchment plus 30%. Yes. Yes, you're going to be incredibly useful. Ex extra entrenchment in addition to the fact that I have a load of entrenchment that have been there for a while. And I also have forts. That's going to really help on that frontage. Okay. Uh, we should also give you a battle plan when you go on the offensive.
There we go. Just use this uh, River of the Natural Defense as much as possible, but I do want to capture this port. Uh, right, who next? This 72 versus Italy. Right, who would be in charge of this? I've got a lot of generals. I'm going to have to promote them. Uh, unfortunately, it's just the way of the world. We're going to need to promote some to uh, get field marshals to be able to actually manage it's such a large number of troops. Uh, Rich O'Connor for the moment can go here. Your offensive line... Uh, frankly... If you can do that... Oh, maybe it's a bit too... No, that's fine. We'll grab the other half of the troops. And we'll put a blockade there along that river, which will give us a natural uh, defense. Right, you. You definitely need to have a commander, because you are going to be using my lightning attack. Now, unfortunately, you have 36 troops, which is going to mean that you need a field marshal, which is unfortunate because... I'm going to need a lot of Field Marshals, and every time I send a Field Marshal, it removes these abilities. Which is very disappointing, because I really like some of these, like Commando, Desert Fox, you're going to be so good for Africa. Um, Urban Assault Specialist, Commando, Panzer Leader, again, really useful, especially for this division, but General. Looks like I just have to promote everyone at this stage. Uh, promote. All positive traits and one skill point will be lost. Well, has to happen. Uh, promote. Now, you might wonder why I'm promoting the ones without, like, the high levels and the awesome skills. Because you lose the skills, so promoting the actual worst is normally the best. Counterintuitively, I know. Uh, oh, yeah. I don't have a 28-4 here anymore, so, uh... That's unfortunate. Oh, we've got extra troops here. Uh, these extra troops can come up here. I am, like I said, worried about this frontage. Since I'm worried about this frontage... You're promoted. No one in charge of you. You are a 24, however. So. Commando. Out of supply, minus 50%. Very useful. Engineer, Mountaineer, Trickster. Mountaineer, Trickster, Engineer. Yeah, you've just got more abilities, so we'll put you on there. What about Asia? You're a six. No, we need a seven. There we go. Now, against the Japanese. Smile can somebody minus 20%. Probably very useful over here. Yeah, let's have you. That's a lot of troops you're in charge of. Um... Who else? Don't need them on the garrisons just yet. Africa. That's going to be like my last choice, really, on who to put there. Uh, again, not really massively enthused by that. Nordic regions. Again, don't really think that's massively going to be an issue. Spain, already done. Yeah, so it's just going to be a, a case of assigning a few more. So I think I'm going to do that during the, uh, the interim break. Uh, you don't need to see me like assign everybody. Just a general idea that we've got the main people focused down on places where I want them. Everyone else is going to be a little bit more. Uh, just grab people. Even just, like, get people right now and just promote them instantly. To Field Marshal. Like, hi, you on the street? Yeah. What's your name? Bernard. Okay, Bernard. Yeah, you're a Field Marshal. What? I've never... I, I don't even know the army. Actually, everyone knows the army by now. I mean, we've recruited pretty much everyone we can for the moment. But for now, I've been at The war will continue, but until then... If you enjoyed, please run a like, not subscribe, please consider subscribing, and of course, stay shiny.